Hey everybody, welcome back to Pikmin. Last time, we started at the Distant Spring, doing a lot of setup in order to get further in the region, get more ship parts, commit more murder with our Pikmin slaves. <clears throat> anyway, uh, yeah, so today we're just gonna, <laughs> we're just gonna go back and uh, continue getting these ship parts. So the first thing I want to do is, if the bomb rocks are back, and they should be, uh, actually, I want to break down this wall that's right here. I want to break that down. But after that, there's another ship part right over there. And, like, I kind of just want to get that out of the way so we can be done with that portion of the map. So we pick one there. I think those were the ones killed by a Wallywog. And then we can just focus on this section here. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to get a ton of blues. Like, I don't know. 95 how about oh i can't actually do that because um shit come on friends join me i'll just put 10 back because i need a certain amount of yellows i don't know exactly how many i need but i'm gonna get 10 out or you know two you know for some of them to get back in the onion and then there that should be fine i'm not gonna worry about the pikmin otherwise um Rather, I'm not going to worry about the numbers I have out. We should be okay. Uh, I just need to throw a few yellows here to get bomb rocks. I should have swarmed them, but whatever. We don't need that many bomb rocks anyway. Yeah, okay, looks like that's it. So let's go and break down this wall over here, and then we'll pretty much have full access to... Oh my god. What are you guys focusing on? Where'd those other go? Others go. What are you focusing? Oh, there's a geyser over there. Right. Don't, don't worry about it. It's okay. Anyone else? Am I missing one? Oh, no, okay. It's because there's three others, um... Not with me that are planted in the ground because they died. Or because flowers died, rather. So, anyway. Uh, we're not going to go back here yet. We're just going to break down this wall. Okay, well, you're dead. Rip. And let's throw one more. And that should break it down. Yep, perfect. So I'm just gonna go and put the yellows back. Um, actually, hmm. I don't put them back. I'll just leave them here. They, they might be helpful for something later. So I'll stick the blues for now and start dealing with some of these Wallywogs, as well as get that ship part. So yeah, this is a very big area, and for a large part of it, I do like to use blues. It's a full army of blue. Oh God, there's two of them! Well, I knew there were two, but I didn't think two would be attacking me at the same time. That's actually never happened before. Uh, how do I deal with this? Well, I'll lead, try to lead one of you over. Come on. Not you. Come on, buddy. Got some fresh, juicy Pikmin for it. For, for it. Where are you going? No. Hey, fucker. Fine, I'll lead this one. Hopefully that's far enough away from the other. Oh, God. Okay, that was almost really bad. Well, it kind of was bad. One died, but... Whatever. What's one Pikmin, really? Go ahead and kill... Wow, you're being really resilient and killing a lot of my Pikmin. That's bad. Oh, well. Killed, like, ten of them. No big deal. Swarm them, guys. Swarm them. And uh, that went a lot better. Uh, I'm not going to worry about the numbers. That's taking the pallet back. Is everyone stuck behind there? Is that just... Okay, whatever. Uh, this egg is interesting. That egg will disappear after day 15. We will tackle what is in that egg, but not yet. <laughs> don't worry about it for now. We'll, we'll, we'll deal with it. But not right now. So these are water dumples. I don't know how to deal with them. I sort of swarm and throw at them until they end up dying, and I usually lose Pikmin to them because I don't care. So, anyway. Uh, this puffy blowhog here, you'll notice the treasure is right nearby. So, I don't know. Let's just go ahead and kill him. What are you doing? Oh, no, it's still alive! Kill him! Kill him! Get the bluffy, get the bl bluffy blowhog down. This, this whole sequence has not been going well. Okay, get him down. Swarm him. All my guys are not with me because they're, they're blown away. All right, there you go. Well, that went well. There's another one! Get out of here! Um... There it is! The Interstellar Radio! That took a while to fall down. I'll just take that back, guys. And, um... 
Oh, I took people off it. Come on, go on. If you had just gone like a more direct path, that would have been better, but hey, whatever. Come on, and I might as well carry some of these water dumbbells back. Get up. Because uh we did lose a decent number of Pikmin there. Not like a terrible amount. Uh, let me just get one off of you if I can so I can carry this one back too. Where do I have one Pikmin? That happens sometimes. I just ha it says I have one Pikmin on me. And clearly I don't, so. Okay, you guys are going a bad way, so I'm just gonna have you carry something else, I guess. There's a five pellet over here. I guess I'll have you guys carry that. Where was that exactly? Come on, be faster. And are you leaves, but come on. Okay, it's right there. I think the Wally Walks take seven to carry, so that's out of the picture. The music for the distance spring, by the way, very, very calm. Very ambient. Um, not really a song that sticks in my head, sort of like the Forest Naval does. Forest Naval, uh, less so than, say, the, uh, like, the Force of Hope, or the Impact Side, even. But it's a good song. But this one, uh, just ambient. That's fine. Just different. Anyway, I'm gonna use that Wap Bomb Rock on that Ball Bear there. Um, just to get rid of it, basically. And get a few more yellows out. Like, let's bring them back in. Uh, let's have, uh, 15 on us, actually. Is that enough? I think I'm gonna get five more just in case. And then I want to get reds out, because we will need reds for something coming up. Oh, actually, there's micromanaging, my multitasking, rather, that I could do. I think I will. Oh, no, we actually didn't get all those walls down on the other side as well. So I'll need to, uh, to do that. So, uh, actually, let me do this. Let's put, um, I have 40 on me? Okay, that's perfect. Take these 40, then. And I will go have them work on the wall. And, uh, and something else. I think there's actually two walls, so I'll split them up by 20. Oh, there's a ship part over there we didn't get. Right. We'll, we'll handle that. This whole part's kind of been haphazard. Uh, so if you leave flower pikmin in the ground too long before plucking them, they will actually die. They will just die. I guess they wilt if you don't pull them out, which doesn't really make any sense, but whatever. Um, so anyway, let's just throw... 20 on here, just to get this wall down. Oh, bloody hell. Well, I'll show off that blue Pikmin can actually save other Pikmin. Come on, save them. You're the worst lifeguards I've ever seen. Holy shit. Well, in theory, they can do that. They don't do a very good job, apparently, but in theory, they can do that, so... Anyway, the rest of you get, um, yeah, get working on that. We'll come back to this later, and we'll have, um, bring some more blue so that they can carry that ship part back for now. Looks like we're getting all these guys back over here, which is good. Do we have any blues to pluck? We do. Let's do that before uh, we head off. I want to get more reds out, because we are going to be doing a bit of fighting here. And the reds are, again, the most efficient for fighting. So, not a full, not full squadron, maybe, but a big, sizable, bigly squadron, you know? It looks like one of those walls was finished. Uh, I'll leave ten blues out, because we will... Actually, we won't really need ten blues specifically. Uh, so I'll just, I'll just put all the blues back. And, uh, I need reds, right? That ball bear is still chasing us, because I guess it hasn't deloaded. Uh, right, I need all these yellows on me. I was gonna say, why do I have so many? But that's because I kind of need them. And we can get 37, uh, reds out. So we can do a bit of fighting. Um, might be a bit troublesome with a team that's small, but I think we'll be alright. Uh, all of them are either buds or leaves, so I'm not going to worry too much about their, uh, their state of life. Uh, let's deal with this puffy blowhog first. So he doesn't blow us into any ball bears. Hopefully I also don't th accidentally throw any Pikmin on a ball bear and wake it up and lose all of them. That would be problematic. And hopefully none of these Pikmin just stupidly decide to focus on a ball bear. Alright. That went well. Any left behind? Nope, we're good. And they finished that other wall. So we can go over there and deal with that in a moment. But let's just go and swarm this one and hopefully finish it off. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, just a little bit more. Yes, okay. Perfect. <laughs> I love how long it takes things to fall um, <laughs> after you kill a blowhawk. It's just like it has to load them and then it has to like recognize you in the area. It's amazing. Anyway. 
Uh, I guess let's just go and deal with what we exactly need yellows for now. Actually, wait. Before we do that, I do want to deal with the rest of these enemies just so we have a significant-ish team on us. Because uh, though yellows are the weakest of the bunch, as evidenced by that example. Oh, come on now. And that one too, I guess. You still chasing us? No, you went back to sleep. I think. What are you doing? Okay, you went back to sleep. You just turned around. Well, that was weird. Let's go ahead and try that again. There we go. That went a lot better. I could probably have grabbed those other Pikmin as well there. They were working on the wall and stuff, but uh, whatever. Um, I guess let's see what this Blowhog too for the hell of it. While we're here with all of our squad drowning in despair. Come on. There we go. So yellows are pretty good. Well, please don't crash up there. Okay, fantastic. We can actually swarm you now. Well, in theory, what the hell? What are you guys doing? Whatever, kill him up there. That's fine. I, I don't need its parts, so. But that's parts, it's drops, so. Just get everyone back here. And, um. There's also some, some sheer groups over here. I'm not worried about those. But I do need. I do want my reds to get on something. Um, before I do what I need to do with the yellows, so. Go and kill this one. Make sure that I can't anything back. And, um... Oh, there's actually some over here. I don't I don't think I've ever even fought these ones. Which is weird, because you think I would have to for... Uh, for getting parts back, but whatever. And then there's finally some right over here. Go and deal with you. And this one left. They can float. It's easier to kill them when they're in the air, because you can just... Whack them once. Well, if you're standing under them. There we go. That one was buzzing for a while. I thought it was still alive. It was really weird. Um, so. I need to put all these blues by the side and ten reds. So. There's ten reds. Got these other reds. And I will have them work on a little project called this wall and a bridge near the wall. And we will need this for later. So. Should be able to put 16 on each one. I think we had 38, right? I don't know. I wasn't. I, I wasn't really paying attention, actually. Anyway, so the rest up here. I'll work on the bridge. I don't know if they'll automatically go to start working on the wall after that, since it's so close. I don't think they will. But uh, hey, maybe. Anyway, I left behind 10 reds because we need to go get that ship part. So uh, not that one. We'll we'll deal with that one later. Uh, mainly because we absolutely do need blues for that, and I don't know if I have enough blues on me. So. But we don't need blues for this one, so we can just go over here with all these slow-ass blues and these fast-ass reds. And carefully lead them across this bridge, because I have just enough on me to get the ship part. Come on. See, I don't know where that one Pikmin I supposedly have in my squad is, because it, I don't have him. Again, that happens sometimes. Pikmin Wii seems to be a pretty glitchy version of the game, but... Control-wise, it's uh, it's definitely the uh, the what's the word definitive version. Please tell me I'm not behind. Fifty. There we go. Fifty-one. Oh, apparently I found him. I don't know where he was, but there he is, working on that now. So whatever. Anyway, I left those yells behind because we do have to do something with them as well, and uh, they are working how well on this bridge and that wall. Wall is not going anywhere. The bridge is kind of going somewhere. Anyway, take these yellows. I don't know what happened to two of them. I guess they died somehow. I don't know. Whatever. May I left put them behind somewhere? Nope, they're just gone. Fantastic. Whatever. Hopefully I don't need 20 then. I think I only need 15, but I could be wrong. But given uh, the ship part we're going to grab here is somewhat precarious, I think they only make you have 15 because it's kind of obnoxious getting a huge squad of Pikmin up anywhere, so... <laughs> anyway, yeah, we need to take these Pikmin up this small ledge and guide them around this cool little, like, small maze area. I kind of like just the, the idea of that this, this is here. Uh, oh, are you kidding me? Oh, I wasn't paying attention at that time at all. Okay, everyone's good. Um, well, we're not going to be able to do that yellow thing. Get off of that nectar. Um, fuck, how are they doing on that part? 
Uh, where are they? Is that them? Okay, they'll be fine. They'll get to the ship in time. Um, fuck, I guess it's have you guys work on this wall. Try and get this wall done as much as possible. We got one ship part today. Again, a little bit more setup. Oh no, we got two ship parts today because we did the Huffy Blog one near the water temples where I lost a ton of Pikmin. So, I don't know. Decent progress, I suppose. The Gluon Drive. I don't even think I mentioned that name. <laughs> I have no idea how it works, but it'll help. Anyway. Uh, just get you guys working on this. For Wait, what? That was weird. Um, let's get you guys working on that as much as possible until the end of the day. Uh, no other Pikmin up behind? Nope, we're good. Everyone else is at the base. Everyone, every enemy's dead, which is fantastic. Well, that guy, but we'll deal with him. Um, well, there's some more devils over there. Never mind, not every enemy's dead, but most of them are dead. The big ones are dead. The big, the big problems. The bad ombres. Kind of want you to finish this wall. I feel like you can. The last couple seconds here. Could very well be wrong. Oh, they did! Oh my god! Thank, that's amazing. All right. So, we got a lot of first things to do tomorrow. Um, I kind of want to be done with taking Yellow Pikmin out of the Onion. So, I think we'll deal with that first, and then uh, just uh, finish up everything else. Seems like a good plan, so I don't want to, like, think about how many Pikmin I need to get out with yellows and just worry about mainly blues and reds. Uh, mainly blues. We're really just going to be using blues from... Um, well, not really. We have to use reds for one thing. Never mind. We're going to be using a uh, bit of equal blue and reds. Maybe a bit more blue than reds, but anyway. So he's talking about the area and how many ship parts are there, and yeah. That was looking good, still. Huge dip in blue Pikmin, I think we know when that was. Uh, I don't know where those two yellow Pikmin died, but whatever. <laughs> and uh, yeah, we're doing well. So, there's not much else to say there. Uh, we will deal with that egg in the distant spring. That's something I'm sure some of you guys want to see a lot. And, I don't know, we might finish the distant spring next time? I can't guarantee it. I mean, there's still six ship parts, so... That's, uh, that's quite a bit. But, hey, if we manage it well, we might be able to do it. So, we'll see. See you guys then.